entrance to the cave behind his cover. What's that? A hidden spring. with an illusion. No, but he might have figured on scaring us half to death. Keep your eyes closed. Yeah, I remember. That light hypnotizes you. We'll fake it. Can't you hear me? Tell him you're all right, but you need help. I'm all right, but I need help. How do I get in there? Through the hermit shack on Mount Vulcan. There's an opening in the rear wall, behind the cupboard. Tell him you'll meet him in a tunnel and bring him here. I will meet you in a tunnel and bring you here. Okay, I'm on my way. Monitor. One moment, Orphan. 
four. Assemble all the guards. Take the Earth people to the palace and keep them there. By force if necessary. Very well, sir. It's time I put an end to an impossible situation. I could get along without Professor Dawn. I'd like to get this cannon working again in case we need it. Yeah. You hide. I'll see what they're up to. taking me to the planet palace everyone must go there the robot men are taking everybody to the palace Rude must have escaped and is giving them orders perhaps rex will come soon with help until he does, we must submit and let Groot make the moves. I'll go with Ella. You assemble the small emergency kit of Dornite and stand by here. What's up? I don't know. Planet men don't seem to know either. dictate my terms of submission to the nations of the world. Are you sure this is the right time? Why not? I have everything under full control here, just as Jarva has on Earth. gimmicks that'll do everything. But here's one of mine that can stop them. Stop! Please, stop! Okay, I'll stop. You bring these two out of that trance or whatever it is. Good thing I did. Let's look over these gadgets. We'd better put him under control first. He's liable to turn it off and send it flying through the air. All right, good idea. Oh. 
With this, he can see anything fairly close by, even through rocks or walls. Take a look. It's probably set on the cave where you met Darl. This is the gadget with which Grood can read your subconscious mind. He found out all about you from Darwin. This is a stellar scope. It can reach almost anything in space. Now what's that? It's Grood trying to call here from Urgro. Let's try. We'll call him when we're ready. Say, he ought to be done by now. Dr. Grood calling Jarva on the planet Earth. Come in, Jarva. Why doesn't Jarva answer me? Perhaps he's busy or... He has nothing to do but wait for my call. I'll find out what's up. I'll synchronize the fluoro ray with the telescope. Jarva and taken control of my Earth headquarters. I must deal with their plotting. Cut the Cosmonium power booster into the Orion circuit. You two take off for Ergo any time you want. We'll use Doran's atomic plane. Why not a Cosmojet? Because Rude could take remote control of it and destroy it. What about you? Oh, don't worry about me. I can handle that guy. If it's tough, I'll put him back in the cooker. Let's see if we can find some cosmonium power units. They might come in handy. The fools. Do they think I can't destroy their atomic plane also? Is there a cosmojet on the launching platform? Yes, sir. Then put that neutron detonator in it. I'll adjust the remote control firing device. Heading right for us. It's one of Groot's Cosmo Jets. It's going to ram us. 